Hello friends, welcome to the channel ID Simplified. In this quick video on Azure, I'm here to show you how you can use service tags in order to block the internet running on a machine in the Azure infrastructure. So let's get started. If I can show you, I have a machine running with the name uh, DC. And when I create this machine, by default, there are certain rules which are created. The important thing is uh, by default, are these rules you cannot delete them so you the only way to you know get the precedence over there is to have a rule which has higher priority so if i can go to the nsg i want to show you that uh, internet is allowed on this machine so it is under the outbound security rule you can see it has a priority and uh, by default the internet is allowed now if i want to delete this you can see it's grayed out for me because as i said by default I cannot delete, but I can create a new rule which has a precedence over this default rule. So let's do that. But before I do, let me actually show you that I can reach the internet. So I'm gonna go and ping Google and you can see that I'm able to reach. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do a continuous ping for this. And in the meantime, let's go on the Azure site. Let's go and click on Outbound Security Rule. Under the source, I'm going to put any. Source point range, also any. Destination. In this case, I'm going to use service tag. And that is what makes it useful that it has a pre-built Azure services. And uh, I can allow and uh, deny some of the rules with that. So I'm going to pick deny. And for the destination port range, I'll pick any two in this case. Protocol will be any. Action will be denied because I don't want internet. And make sure that this number, the priority number, is lower than this number because when the number is lower, it has got precedence over the default rule. You can give the name for this. Name it description on add and it should not take that long all right the rule was applied successfully and as you can see that uh, my rule is now available under the outbound security rule so let's confirm by going on to my server and if I can go in here you can see that the request is timed out it means I'm not able to reach internet from this machine so this way you can use service tag to allow or deny certain services and in this video we saw how you can utilize service tag to prevent internet from your machine running on the azure infrastructure i hope you found this video useful thanks for watching have a good day